In a quite trusting atmosphere of neonatal unit, where life began its most fragile journey, no one suspected that a predator lurked among the staff. Welcome to MC News. We bring you the horroring story of Lucy Letby, the neonatal nurse who turned a place of healing into a scene of unimaginable tragedy. Lucy Ledby, a dedicated nurse, was known for her gentle demeanour and wavering dedication to her tiny patients. But behind her caring facade, dark intention festered. Between 2015 and 16, a series of unexplained death and near-fatal collapses occurred in the neonatal unit at the Countess of Chester Hospital in London. Babies who seemed to be on the road of recovery suddenly dies. Parents heartbroken sought answers that seemed elusive. As the number of incidents grew, hospital staff became increasingly alarmed. An internal investigation began, led by Dr. Stephen Berreri and his team. They noticed a disturbing pattern. Lucy Ledby, a seemingly dedicated and gentle nurse, was present during each of these tragic events. This pattern could not be ignored. And in 2017, police launched a detailed investigation. The evidence uncovered was chilling. It was discovered that Letby had been deliberately harming these infants under her care. She injected air into their bloodstream, administered excessive doses of milk and poisoned them with insulin. Notes found in her home contained confessions and detailed plans for actions. In July 2018, Letby was arrested on suspicious of murder. The community and her colleagues were in shock. How could someone entrusted with care of these most wonderful lives betray that trust so horrifically? The trial began in October 2022 and the prosecution presented overwhelming evidence of Ledby's guilt. She was charged with the murder of seven babies and attempted murder of six more. Ledby maintained her innocence but the jury found her guilty on all counts. This was a cruel, calculated and cynical campaign of child murder. The order of the court, therefore, is a whole life order on each and every offence and you will spend the rest of your life in prison. In August 2023, Lucy Ledby was sentenced to life imprisonment without the possibility of any parole. The judge condemned her actions as a gross breach of trust and a crime of unspeakable cruelty. In a recent development, Lucy Ledby sought to challenge her convictions at the Court of Appeal in London, presenting four grounds of appeal. On May 24, 2024, her request was denied by Dame Victoria Sharp and Lord Justice Holroyd. Sharp, the president of King's Bench Division, stated that the court refused leave to appeal on all grounds and associated application. A full judgment will follow. Letby, who received 14 whole life sentences, is due to face a retrial on the court of attempt murder at Manchester Crown Court next month. This court, having heard her application, has decided to refuse leave to appeal on all grounds and to refuse all associated applications. A full judgment will be handed down in due course and any consequential applications can be determined at that stage. All existing reporting restrictions remain in place. They told me that there's going to be a lot more deaths and that I feel like to sort of there for a lot of them. Did you have any concerns that there was a rise in the mortality rate? Yes. Okay, so tell me about that. What concerns did you have? I think we don't just notice as a, as a team in general that this and staff that this was a nice compared to previous years. This case has left an indelible mark on the community and the medical profession. The neonatal unit, once a place of hope and new beginning, now carries the scars of Ledby's betrayal. Measures have been implemented to prevent such tragedies from happening again, but the families affected will forever bear the pain of what they have lost.